shit, Jill! The meaning of coincidence is utterly subjective and can be evaluated only by the person experiencing it. And where were you the night of Professor Bennett's murder? Uh, at the pub. You're quite sure? Yes, that's right. And what was your relationship like with the deceased? You can't think I had something to do with his death. Answer the question, Mr. Perry. Uh, I admired him. It was a privilege to study under him. Well, we're looking at two women in his life dead from the same type of gunshot wound decades apart. Both listed as suicide. You're not arresting Bart? If only it were that easy. Now, first, let me see if I can get Richmond County to reopen the case. What? We nailed Corbin. It'll be thanks to her, and you know it. It's a minivan. No, Shane. It's your minivan. It's your wedding present. Oh my god, Dad, Mom, thank you. It's it. Come in handy for Renault's and. And in a few years, it could be useful. Mm -hmm. See you in a minute, okay. honey. Dr. Corbin! Looks like we caught you just in time. Richmond County Police have reopened the Dolly Hearn case. As such, you've been named a person of interest in the death of your wife. Well, it's come to that, has it? Child services are here. And I have a court order, too. Your children are being placed in the care of their aunt and uncle. What are you on, Shane? I've never been on anything. I've never cheated. I've never crashed the car. I never lied to my parents. Oh, come on, Shane. Then who ripped the side mirror off the car? Uh, Sandy, that was me. My disappearing bottle of Oban? Uh, over here. I have a ridiculous amount of sick days! I've always done what's expected of me, and I've always been okay with that. But then I got this fucking minivan, and I realized that if I get married today like you're all expecting me to, then I will never have rebelled, not once in my life, and I will resent it. And I don't want to bring that resentment into our relationship. Is there anything else you remember about that day? I don't know. Kuchenko's on stage. Something before the shooting. It was a girl. Ah. A photographer. She wanted a better view than the press area provided. Well, she was a pretty girl, I guess. Oh, no. No press passes were issued to any female photographers. 